In this video, I will show you how to convert your WooCommerce website into your own multi-channel order management system. First, let's go to plugins and click a button add new. We are searching for a plugin called multi-channel for WooCommerce that is developed by Geekseller. Let's click install and activate. After the activation, you will see a new link on your menu called multi-channel. This is the page with settings for the plugin which we just installed. As you can see, first we have to register it. Let's click on the button register now. After successful registration, you will now see a button called manage integrations. Let's click on it and add some integrations. The integrations page is empty at the moment because we have to add the first marketplace. Let's click add new integration. Let's start with Amazon. I will click create. This is taking me to my Amazon account where I have to approve Geekseller having access to my order details. As you can see, I connected it correctly. Now let me go back to my WooCommerce website. Within 10 to 15 minutes, you should already see orders coming to your WooCommerce orders section. The first change you will see on this page are additional columns. You can see marketplace status, source, and marketplace order ID. You can search for the marketplace order ID using this WooCommerce search. You can also use filters to filter by status on the marketplace and source of the order. This is important to understand the difference between status, which is your WooCommerce order status, and marketplace status. Status is just a status of your order as you define it in WooCommerce. The marketplace status is the status which is coming from the marketplace. So when this is open, that means the marketplace sees this as open, unfulfilled order yet. If you fulfill this order by providing tracking number, within about half an hour, the marketplace should receive the tracking change the status of this order to shipped and then this open status under the marketplace status column should change to shipped. Now let's go to the order details page and see how you can fulfill this order. On the edit order page, you will see a new box called order details. Those are information which came from the marketplace. One thing that you can notice is the warning. This warning states that you receive an order from the marketplace with a SKU which doesn't exist on your WooCommerce, which means WooCommerce was not able to reduce quantity on this product. This is about ABC2 SKU. As you can see, my ABC1 SKU exists on my WooCommerce. So quantity, quantity was reduced when this order came. Now, if you click on this link over here to see details of this product, you will see that you actually have this product here with the same SKU that exists on the marketplace and you have manage stock level activated. So you have to remember that if SKU matches between your WooCommerce and Marketplace and you have Manage Stock Level turned on over here, then every time you receive an order from the Marketplace, quantity for this product will be reduced accordingly. Now, in order to fulfill this order, we have to add a tracking number. You can see here a new box called Order Shipment. 
Let's click Add Tracking Number, select a career, select a method and insert tracking number. Now we click Save and you can see tracking number appeared here. Within about 10 minutes, this tracking number will be sent to the marketplace. This is important to remember that if you add another tracking number, it's not going to be used anymore. At the moment, this plugin is taking only one tracking number that you added initially. Another important thing to mention here is that all this data about billing, shipping, and also information about quantities, total, shipping cost, all of this is taken directly from the marketplace. So this information should match. Another important fact is that this multi-channel for WooCommerce plugin is compatible with other plugins which you may use for creating tracking numbers. The first one is WooCommerce Shipment Tracking. This is a pretty popular plugin that allows you to add tracking numbers to your orders. If you activate this and then go to orders and visit again this order, you will now notice that you don't have only order shipment here, which came with the original plugin, but also you have shipment tracking, which was added by this additional tracking plugin. It doesn't matter to which box you will insert your tracking number. If you add your tracking number here, instead of, instead of order shipment, the multi-channel for WooCommerce plugin will recognize it. There's also another very popular plugin that is called WooCommerce Shipping and Taxes. This plugin allows you to generate labels for USPS and DHL directly within your WooCommerce interface. This plugin is compatible with multi-channel for WooCommerce plugin. So if you generate labels within WooCommerce interface and tracking number is provided, then this tracking number will be automatically also sent to the marketplace. Let's go back again to the multi-channel plugin settings page. And I wanted to mention you can contact support of this plugin via email or via live chat. You simply click on live chat and this will redirect you to the page with your integrations and with a chat box, which is available during the US office hours. Thank you.